Hello everyone, this is Melanie from Melanie B's Creative Studio and welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna to talk about some diamond paintings and I'm gonna check the quality and just see if everything is consistent with the last diamond painting video I did for everyday crafts. Now I'm gonna put that website right here so you can see the spelling of it, but in the description below, I will also put a link so you can go straight to their website. Now, I'm not affiliated with them. This order came out of my pocket. They had sent me an email about a collaboration. So the last video you watched was me unboxing and reviewing and going over some paint by numbers and some diamond paintings. Well, what I like to do when I have a company that collaborates, I like to place an order myself so that I can check to be sure that I'm not getting something special as a YouTube influencer than you would get if you made a purchase as a customer. So I went ahead and about a week or so after they contacted me, um, I ordered three diamond paintings from their like $3.99 category. I have opened one, but I haven't reviewed it or looked at it or anything. I just wanted to see if this was what this order was because the funny part was sometimes, you know, I worry that when I collaborate with a company that they're like expediting my packages and I'm telling you, oh, it only took two weeks, but that's because they expedited mine. So I wanted to place this order to see how long it would take in actuality. So this package of three diamond paintings came the same day as my package with the collaboration. So that to me was pretty impressive considering they did not know who was ordering these and the time frame was the same. So I'm gonna put the dates of when I ordered and when I received right here for this. And, um, and that way you'll know how long it takes in general during the pandemic. Things can change, you guys. If we go back to lockdown, you know, because of COVID-19, that could change if we, they might be faster in the future if that's not an issue anymore. So, you know, this is just my experience with this. So let's look at these each. And I won't go through a lot. I just want to show you what the designs are and everything. So the design of the first one I got for my husband. All right. So my husband loves the Grinch because he says he is a Grinch. So and he's pretty accurate about that, especially in the morning before coffee. Otherwise, he's, he's not. But anyway, his ringtone on his phone is the Grinch theme song. You're a mean one. And uh, he, he doesn't just do that at Christmas. It is all year long. So that is, that's him, he's a Grinch. And also, I made ornaments, which I'm gonna do one day. I'm gonna make glitter ornaments that are the Grinch and show you how I make them. But I made him a Grinch ornament because of the fact that he, he relates to the Grinch. So that's what this one is. Sorry, y'all know my stories. So that's how I chose it. <laughs> all right, so we see all of the vibrant colors poured glue canvas. I'm gonna put my coffee, my Contigo on the corner here and a vase to be able to see this flat. So let's look at this first. Now it was bent, but when I pull back my plastic, I can see that there's no like creases or anything in the adhesive, so that's a really good thing. There might be in the plastic, but there's not in the, the canvas itself, okay? So this is that same plastic canvas that I showed you on the collaboration diamond painting. The This is exactly the same, like consistency-wise, with the schematic on the right and the schematic on the left. This piece has 20 gorgeous colors, and I feel like, honestly, I want to work on this before anything else and give it to my husband at Christmas because this is, this is him, y'all. I mean, he's a handsome guy, but he can be a little grinchy. So <laughs> we have our tools <laughs> consistently, and we have all of our drills that are beautifully packaged, nicely marked to match and coordinate with our color schematic. So I want to show you guys, um, I'm gonna try to zoom in a little bit here, the colors and the clarity on these the schematic is incredible, the color code. So y'all, I really think that even though the canvas is kind of that plasticky texture and it's thick, I really do like the quality of their pieces. And again, four bucks, 
I mean, this one might have come, one of these might have come from that $7.99 category, but y'all, really? I mean, I know it's a small, small canvas, round drill. So the only problem that might occur is that with a round drill and a small canvas, you lose a lot of detail and it looks very pixelated up close. So, you know, that might be an issue I run into. So if I finish this one ever in my life, I will definitely come back and show you how it looks overall because I'm really wanting to do this so bad as if I have time, but I like to try. All right, I wanna look at the other two. I won't go through all the details. And I also didn't put any drills on this one yet as a sample because I did that in the first video I did for Everyday Crafts and their diamond painting. And I think I can have a little link right here for you to go see that video or right here. I can't remember which way it goes. But anyway, so that way you can see the tack of the adhesive. You can see the sparkle of the drills and all that stuff. Now I haven't even opened this one as far as like scissors or anything. Let's see, these are so hard to get open because they, they seal so well. So I have to be careful when I open it, but I don't actually cut through a canvas. See how close it is to the top? So I have to be really careful. You be careful too. This one is gonna be this painting. All right, her eyes look a little creepy. Hopefully she won't look like that once we're done. But again, small canvas round drill. So it might be that, you know, this is one that I should have gotten larger, probably so. But um, I don't know why I've had my eye on badass Tinkerbell since like the day I started diamond painting. So she's got tattoos. Y'all, I don't even have tattoos. I mean, like I have one tattoo that I got with my son that died uh, before he passed. And so I don't know why the Marilyn Monroe diamond painting I did, she's all tatted up, but it's the rainbow colors that appealed to me. And something about Tinkerbell being kind of a badass, I'm like living vicariously through her maybe, but I don't know why I've always liked this painting. Okay, so this one has 18 colors. Our schematic is the same. They only have it on one side, I guess probably because this is such a small canvas. And I will put the dimensions of what size this is in the right here so that you can see that. Drills, everything has been very consistent. So let's look at our next painting. Um, and I hate that the glare is so strong on this plastic, but you know, my lights, I have to have them. Let me move it back a little bit, that might help. All right, so anyway, badass Tinkerbell. So this is the image for this painting. And it's another Grinch. So I think, and I'm not sure yet, I think this one's going to my granddaughter. She is a, a 10 and a half, almost 11 year old. And she's got this, I don't know. I can't even explain her. <laughs> she's just different. I love it. She's so unique and has her own idea about things. And so she's not girly and she hates everything girly, but I think that she would probably like this Grinch because he's not girly and uh, this is just a cute piece. Either way, so I have two Grinch paintings. Schematic on the left, schematic on the right, 15 colors in this piece, predominantly green. You see all those beautiful greens, yep. And round drill, same tools. So you guys, that is what I was checking for. I was not only checking for the shipping speed on an order that I placed myself, but I was also checking for consistency in products. So, so far I'm seeing 100% consistency. This company's been around for a while. I've been seeing them advertise for at least a year or more but I didn't go buy from them because, you know, I wasn't sure they were trustworthy. And I mean, that's just being honest. Um, but now I have found that they are a legit company and um, I'm pretty happy. Now you don't have a lot of like choices when you go to place an order for a diamond painting. They just have like one option, but you know, again, consider that in the price and then think about how quickly you could probably do a diamond painting this size. Now it's gonna lose resolution and detail because it is a round drill and a small canvas. If you're not sure what I mean by that, be sure to check out the video for the round versus square drills diamond painting video I did last year and that might help you kind of decide if it's something you wanna do. All right, you guys, that's it for today. Please be sure to hit that little subscribe button right there if you haven't already. I was trying to hit 10,000 subscribers by December 1st, but today is November 14th and I'm only 
not quite to seventeen. I'm not quite to seven thousand. So I don't see me getting three thousand subscribers by December first. But you know, it never hurts to dream. Thank you guys for being here and for watching. And for those of you who have subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate every single one of you. And if you guys are interested, I'm on Patreon now and I have different memberships, uh, different levels starting at $4.99 that go up. And depending on which package you sign up for, you will get different perks. So be sure to check that out. I hope I get to see you soon. Thanks as always for watching.